What's up YouTube? We are back again with another video today. Today we're gonna to be opening up our Absolute Power Force booster box, 24 pack booster box. I've had this one in my uh, sealed area for quite a while and Jack Atlas is one of my favorite characters. Uh, 5Ds is like my favorite uh, series. So we're gonna pop these open, see what we can get out of this booster box. Hopefully we will get uh, what is it, the Majestic Star, uh, the cover card, hopefully we can get the Majestic Star Dragon as an ulti. I think that would be really, really nice to get. Uh, so we'll see what we can get out of this booster box here. Kicking it a little old school with this 5Ds opening. Here we go. The absolute power force. First booster pack out of this booster box here. I have to say Jack is my uh, second favorite character uh, next to Kaiba and Bo well I guess you could say Kaiba and Bakura my favorite characters uh, Jack is my third favorite character from all the Yu-Gi-Oh series nice we have Evil Blast for our rare Spider's Lair and again these old packs they do not have uh, a foil and a rare so let's see uh, what we can get. We'll set our rooms over there. Let's check the ratios. 48 commons, 20 rares, one, uh, 14 super rares, and 10 ultras. I do not remember. There should be secrets in here, but they don't list them in the packs. Um, as far as I remember, I cannot remember any of the secret rares off the top of my head but oh my goodness are you kidding me i just spoiled it <laughs> we we just got an ultimate rare which of the black rose and that thing is minty i like it and it's not first edition but it is a really gorgeous gorgeous card uh akiza is obviously my favorite female character from the whole series but Man, that thing is nice. Gorgeous ultimate rare. We're gonna set that over there. And we got Visor Dez as a, it's a uh, Merit card. It's our rare. Alrighty, let's keep going. Did not expect that at all. Consecrated Light, good common. Dracular, Supe, Machine King, and our Chimera. First printing of Chimera. Uh, classic Yugi card. Pot of, oh, there, there's a good common right there. Pot of Quill and Machine Assembly Line. Another good card, Psy Curse. I would say this is a pretty underrated set. Here we go. Are these Euro Packs? quite tell. They don't look like European print, but again, they do have the EAN on them, so that's European English, I believe. Oh, sweet. I can't even see. I'm ruining it. We got Super Rare Phoenix Chain. Awesome. First printing of Phoenix Chain. This card was nuts a few years ago, back in the XC's era. Man, and then that uh, the Secret Rare came out. Burfamet. First printing of Burfamet. Nice. As I skip through a bunch of the other commons here. Gravekeeper Stell. Good common. Alright. Let's keep going here. Gundari, the Pirate of Spirit. Temple of the Sun. Reptilian Servant. Meteor Flare. And Dark Bug. Uh, good for the insects. Insect deck. Layer Wire. Interesting. Reptilians. Reptilians are in here. That's right. Another Pot of Quill. Nice. I need to separate my Phoenix Chain. Set that there. So, so far we'll set our foils there. And 
again for this to be a sealed booster pack I would, or booster box i should say i would love to pull at least yeah, hopefully we can pull a secret rare so we'll see ritual cage decent rare fire ant oil man and shredder uh, it looks like we already got our ulti though unfortunately it was not the majestic star dragon but i'm happy with an ultimate rare which is the black rose uh, oh I apologize for that. So, let's see what we got. Naga, another super. Ooh, Saber Hole, nice. I actually needed one more of this for my X Saber deck. My Kit Blade X Saber deck from the show. So we're gonna need one more for that for his deck. Nice, good super. Uh, Shield Worm, I've never seen this card in my life. This card is going to change defense position, then you send one card to the opponent's deck to the graveyard for each insect. Not bad. Interesting. I do not remember that card at all. These are kind of stuck together, so it's kind of hard to sift through them. Oh, nice. All right. So we got our ultra rare. Waki Meru Urnite. Uh, pretty good card, actually, for the Kawaki Meru archetype. I really like that card. That looks cool. Beast Warrior, so you can search him with Tanky. Uh, he's, he's a good one. I like that. Uh, Jin Curse Enchanter of Rituals. For the Jins and the Ritual decks. So we got few more packs on this right side here. So far we're doing pretty good. Ultimate, uh, I believe it's a s ultimate rare. Which is the black rose. So that's the ultimate printing of a rare. Nature's Reflection. Advanced Force, Swordmaster, and ooh, Gravekeeper's Descendant. Very good rare. Nice, good, good card. No, and there's our playset of a Pot of Quill. Good card. For those Earthbound Immortal uh, Oracle of the Sun decks with the uh, Moon and Sun Dragon. This thing does not want to come apart. Uh, Supe, speaking of. Uh, Panda Borg, Forgotten Temple, Black Photon, and Power Pickaxe for our rare. Good deal. Let's see if we can get one more foil on this side. That would be. Uh, that would be pretty awesome, actually. Absolute power force. Such an old set. Oh, we did. There it is. Uh, Tuner Scheme. Nice. Another super rare. Activate only when a synchro monster special summon to your opponent's side of the field. Take control of that synchro monster. Remove and play when it's destroyed. Destroy that card. Feel. Uh, so there could be like good in like Christrons or uh, what was the ones that came? TGs. TGs came out during 5Ds. Um, this is probably the. This is around the time that I actually was no longer playing Yu Gi Oh! I uh, wasn't really buying or playing Yu Gi Oh! Um, at the time, but I, it was around during the very the first three sets of the 5Ds, and that's why I really enjoyed 5Ds era Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, plus, I really enjoyed the anime, uh, one of the most, one of the best ones. Nice Cyber Dragons Y. All right, Fire Ant Askater. Nice. All right, so five foils on our right side of our box. Uh, we're gonna continue on. Excuse me. And we will we'll move on into the left side. So hopefully we can get a secret rare. I have to see what we can do here. Advanced force. Tricular. Unicycular. Alright, so uh, doing well with the foils here. There's another Oracle of the Sun. It goes along with our Pot of Quill and the uh, Earthbound Immortal deck. Good. And Shieldworm again. Alright. Viper's Rebirth. Awesome. Gravekeeper Stealth. Advanced Force. 
Sheen King, Weeping Idol. Ooh, offering to the Immortals. And it looks like we got a backwards card here. We do. There it is, Kodaris. So offering to the Immortals for the rare. Struck Potion, Kodaris, and Rose Fairy. For our rares. Or, I'm sorry, commons. Reptilian Servant, Break Drawer, Naga, and Jin Prognosticator. One of those classic Jin cards to go along with the Necroz deck. Power Invader, nice. Jack Atlas card. Let's get a Synchro Monster. We should really, really try to get a Synchro Monster out of here. That would be great uh, for a box opening of this set. Especially a foil synchro birth met again. Nice. Alright. Power Invader. Okay. Power cards that went along with Jack's uh, Jack's team of his deck with the resonators. The power monsters. Come on, let's get that synchro monster. Uh, oh nice. Dragon Queen of Tragic Endings. Uh, what was her name in the show? Uh, Car uh, Misty. Misty was played this with her uh, Reptilian deck. I believe it was what it was. Cool card. Really, really cool card. Cool looking uh, artwork on it, but not a great card. Anyway, happy with another foil. Chimera again. Alright, cool. Halfway through this side, looks like we got about seven, boost, six or seven booster packs left out of 24 packs of this box opening. Visor does nice. All right, for our rare destruct potion, oil man. All right. Yep, we have six booster packs left. Still got to get, hopefully, get that secret rare or that synchro monster. So far, only one Ultra, called the Reaper. Magic Hole, Meteor Flare, and nope, Weeping Idol. Another Evil Blast, Kodaris, Rose Fairy, okay. Consecrated Light, good common. Supe and oh, Power Pickaxe. Okay. Fire Ant. Alrighty. Four more to go. Meteor Flare. Black Photon. And Reptilian Visaki. That'll go along with my Reptilian deck. That is about to be completed. For, I believe it was Misty. I think I said that earlier. In this video, Misty played the Reptilians. Ooh, x Saber Garsum, nice. Big fan of the x Saber archetype, again. Working on finishing up uh, a deck of the x Sabers for Kit Blade from the Arc 5 series. Uh, he was the character in the show that played the exit for archetype. And his deck was actually pretty cool. Magic Hole Golem, Tricular, and Drill Synchron. Classic Yusei card. Alright, Viper's Rebirth, Apotiquil. Nice. Alright, one more Bishop back. Can we get it? Can we end with a Synchro Foil? Uh, let's get an ultra rare. We, we really need at least one more ultra. Reptilian Servant. Meteor Flare. Reptilian Naga. Ah, oh, an Ogre of the Black Shadow. Uh, but I'm happy that is a Jack card. That's a Jack Atlas card. He played it in, I believe, Season 1 of the 5Ds, if I remember correctly. Uh, pretty interesting card, actually. Um, less cool. We ended with another, we ended with a foil. So, Sending Soul for our Rituals. 
Rose Fairy, Lair Wire, and Reptilian. So that is it, guys. Um, unfortunately, only one Ultra. Again, Ultras in these older sets are a lot more difficult uh, to obtain. So kind of disappointed that we only pulled one out of one box. Um, but we did pull quite a few Supers. Oracle. Tuner Scheme. Our Ultra Rare Kawaki Mero Urnite. Didn't even pull a secret, but we did get an ulti. Saber Hole. Right, there's our ulti there. Our Fiendish Chain. So is that six supers? Our ultimate Witch of the Black Rose, which looks awesome, by the way. My favorite rarity in the game. So a total of eight foils from our booster box. So thank you guys. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let us know of any openings that you would like to see in the future. Again, we, uh, we thank you, and we will be getting back to you guys with more videos. Thanks, and bye.